Well, you might be thinking, 100 holes of golf, you gotta be kidding me. Yes, it's 100 holes, but it's totally doable. You don't have to be a triathlete. We've had young teenagers play all the way to a 70-year-old man play 100 holes in one day for us. 100 holes uh, is a little tiring. Not quite as bad as I thought. We start uh, at seven and it's no big deal. We'll be done by five. In fact, we could play more, but we don't. 100 holes, love it. It was challenging, but it was still, I could do another 30 holes. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have some modified rules that make the 100 holes very doable. You can play two or three balls off the tee, and that counts as two or three holes of your play. So, you, especially the par threes, you can launch two balls there, they're easy to track. You don't have to travel 100 holes to play 100 holes, uh, you might travel 50 or 60. If your ball's within a putter's length of the hole, that's a gimme. So get one of those long belly putters, you know, four, five, six footer there, and you got a lot of gimmies waiting for you. You cannot do worse than triple bogey. That's the beauty for the non-golfer that wants to play in this. You get to three over par on your hole, you just pick that ball up with a smile on your face and head to the next tee. We have people who play this event that are single digit handicappers. We also have people who only play golf once a year and this is their time to play. Golf is the most wonderful and, and maddening day you can possibly spend. A lot of good shots and a lot of really bad shots. I didn't do all of these. We own the course for the day, so the bad golfers can spray their shots all over and they're not going to hit people. They provide all the balls you can lose here, and I've lost most of them. <laughs> Come on! <Ugh. laughs> Well, I can't think of a better way to people spend a day golfing than to be here with their friends raising money for the kingdom. I pretty much take whatever time I can to help any kids out there. I think that's the most important thing you should do. There's one reason that we do what we do, and that's because we want to give young people hope. Playing golf here today isn't just a game. It's hope for these kids. You know, the sponsorship is not that tough. I think four or five hours spread out over six to eight weeks, you're there. It's really easy considering the fact that what you're doing it for. It's one of the easiest things, just ask and let, let God take care of it. As you're out there raising sponsorship for the Golf Challenge, don't forget to tell people why you're doing it. You'll be impacting young people for all of eternity. <laughs>